Today, Rog and myself will be area locked. Every 30 minutes, we'll spin a wheel and have to stay in that location. If we want to kill anything in that location, we need to buy a weapon from a shop in that area. We start with 100k and a construction cape. We are allowed to skill except from mining, woodcutting, and fishing. And if we want to change our spell books, we won't be able to do it in our house. Then we fight. All right, piece of jeez. I'm going to go ahead and spin my first location, see where we're going to be. Uh, I am on the Lunar Spellbook. That's what I'm going to be choosing as my spellbook to start off with. And we are going to the Wilderness. Okay. I don't know how good that's going to be with 100k, to be honest. But we'll see. The only real shop in the whole Wilderness is the Mage Bank Shop, which sells the runes, or um, I could buy the... God stars, but they cost like 80k and I won't be able to then like buy enough runes or anything. So I know this is shops only or it's at least titled shops only, but I'm probably not going to hit a shop in the first 30 minutes, which is quite interesting. Uh, so I'm going to start my timer. I'm going to teleport to um, level 50 wilderness here and I think I'm just going to use the rogues chest. It recently got buffed, um, which makes it a lot better. We can probably get ourselves some prayer pots. Um, some food. If we get any food, I'll let you know. Um, these ancient ice sacks could be pretty good. I don't know if you can get vengeance sacks from this as well. I didn't actually look into that. All right, guys, welcome. First location, 30 minutes on the clock. Let's see where we spin. I have no idea really off the top of my head what's... Mm. I mean, I know a lot of these locations have dragon weapons. And I guess at the end of the day, that's what we want. Try to get more money, buy more from shops, try to get drops. It's it's a bit of a tricky one not knowing what you're going to get next. Caridian Desert. Uh, off the top of my head, they don't have the best shops. I've been playing this amazing game with great graphics, brutal boss battles, deep tactical gameplay, and literally hundreds of champions to unlock. The worlds of Raid Shadow Legends and Monster Hunter are colliding in an amazing limited time crossover. From January 9th to March 5th, players will be able to collect five Monster Hunter themed legendary champions. Everyone will be able to get the Wrath of the Lost Blade Master legendary champion for free simply by logging into Raid for seven days between now and March 5th. You can also get the other for Monster Hunter themed champions via special in-game events. And that's not all, the Cursed City update is the most exciting thing to happen to Raid since the Doom Tower. It has over 100 stages to complete, including stages where you'll need to take down two of Raid's bosses at the same time. If you haven't started playing yet, what are you waiting for? Click my link in the description or scan my QR code to get insane bonuses available only via my link. You will immediately receive 500k silver, energy, and chicken, and the epic Juliana after reaching level 15. I've also just started a clan under the name Lynx Ocarina. So once you're in game, come and join, and let's crush some dungeons. All right, guys, we have the Caridian Desert. It is not the best place, but it's certainly not the worst. A uh, quick overview. Lots of shops now. Carid. We have the crafting shop. We have the Ali Morrisane rune shop. We can get gems right there. I believe just sapphire and emerald. Sapphire being the most important one, of course. Um, we have access to all in here. We can get the ring of shadows. 75k. Probably won't bother with that. This shop is huge. A lot of rune equipment. Uh, that shop's kind of pointless. That shop's kind of pointless because we get lobsters. We can't fish. That's off limits. Um, but we have the agility pyramid, which isn't resource skilling it's agility and we're allowed to catch things like implings and stuff so i'm assuming the agility pyramid is completely fair game i'm not doing any mining not doing any wood cutting and this challenge is all about shops and making money with shops is going to be the most crucial thing all right so let's start that timer we don't have to buy a pass because we can just tell you right in the desert let's buy some robes um let's buy just a few ah they're dirt cheap i'd rather make sure i have enough than not have enough. Uh, let's go to Polvenich. And we're going to run up to Narda. I actually don't know if it's quicker to take the carpet to Narda and run down. It might be quicker to run down. But then again, I'll save run energy. So you know what? We'll, we'll take the carpet and start making as much money as possible. Uh, see, 30 minutes is not a lot of time. I believe the agility pyramid is about 200k an hour. That is, of course, assuming I started the timer when I was there. But I needed to get this stuff. And we have to travel there. And then we have to spend time going to all the shops, buying all of our stuff. So I want to say I'll probably get like 22, 23 minutes. I need to make sure I buy everything I want. 
and I'd rather have two minutes left over at the end of each region than just completely blowing it and not buying something I need. So I'm going to play it on the safe side and make sure I get everything. So let's run down and make some money. All right, we're coming up on our last little lap here because like I said, we are not risking this at all. We're gonna cash it in. Then we're gonna use our cape to teleport to Edgeville. We go to our house, go to Edgeville, get a run back, and then just sweep in a nice downward motion, starting in Alcrid through Narda and just buying everything we have to buy. First things first, we're gonna buy a Keras Partisan because it is 60K and it's really good, actually. 60K, I'll take one. It's it's a big purchase. We actually can't Alc this either. Uh, 45 strength, 58 stab attack, super good. Uh, we're gonna buy some crafting supplies and some cosmic runes. Uh, you know what? Let's just buy everything we think we might need. I, I mean, I really highly doubt I'm, I'm gonna need this shit, but... It's in the region and it's dirt cheap. Selection of runes, please. Buy other runes. Okay, we'll buy 10 cosmics. Yeah, I mean, we could go magic, I guess, with this shop here, but... there There isn't really a solid way to get magic here unless we get... Just buy this, I'm not gonna hop. Unless we actually get Kandarin. Ah, I forgot to get water runes. It's not the worst thing. I mean, I could go back and, and get them, but I'd rather get 10k, honestly. All right, this is the kind of tricky part. How much is this shit? 59, 45. Okay, let's just buy all this stuff first. Just fills out the gear. Um, I might just YOLO it. Fuck it. Fuck it. I'm not going to think about it. I'm not going to fucking think about it. We're going to get one more trip in with the agility pyramid. Okay, let's cash this in. Maybe I could actually telly and buy runes real quick. It's so annoying to open up that rune shop. Sell. Oh, I don't think we're gonna get it, but we're gonna try. Shit, 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 13 seconds. I actually might try to buy nature runes instead because I can't buy bulk runes. Uh, other runes, other runes. 10. Uh, yeah, okay. Woo, uh, didn't get the waters, but yeah, I mean, in case we want to alk something, like, if we decide we don't want, like, a rune chain body, rune plate body, alks are going to be incredibly crucial in a challenge like this, if you want to change what we get. Um, yeah, I mean, pretty basic plan, but pretty effective. I mean, for the first region, pretty good melee stats, pretty good magic defense. Um, the best magic defense we can get in this region, I'm pretty sure, so I will take it. And let's spin that wheel, guys. What are we going to get next? Probably should have taken off Critian Desert. Wilderness. Huh. Boom. There's 25 mantas that I am going to get myself banked. Right, boom. Happy days. We are back. Just going to reset my stats here. Just got half a prayer potion there, which could be useful. And two dragon stones. I'm going to dip there because I'm about to run out of prep anyway. All right, and a third inventory. Main reason I'm taking this is I've got 11k. And I would much rather at least come out of the wildy with some money to work with. Um, because obviously I'm not able to kill anything. So I'm not really making any money at the moment. Um, so yeah, 11k there. Uh, the rest is all fairly pointless, I think. For right now at least. Maybe it'll be useful later. But yeah, right now, a bit pointless. Okay, I'm dipping, I'm dipping. We just got 18 blighted anglerfish and 25 mantas. That's so big. All right, last bank before we're going to run out of time. I'll come back and spend like the last minute or so just seeing if we can get anything. Uh, the only thing here is the iron ore, really, because we've got so much coal, we can now make some bars uh, if I want to. And that has not gone well. This has not ended well. <laughs> I am going to die here. Can I get another, can I get another chest? Hello. GL. GL, GL. But it's so quick to get back there. Like, it's stupid quick. Boom. Teleport to destination. And I'm already back. So it's not, it's not massive. All right, this is probably going to be the last chest. Certainly going to be, actually. Boom. What are we going to get? 12 emeralds. All right, let me get out of here. And we will spin the next location. Okay, the wilderness has now been removed from my wheel, so we'll see where we're going for our second out of four locations. Kebos Lowlands. Oh, I don't think that's very good. All right, guys, here we are. We have a steel dagger to pick up to start off this 30 minutes. It is the best weapon we can get right off the bat. I did clarify how it linked. He said you can buy or pick up a weapon to use. We can't use the Keras 
in this region to kill anything. We can't punch anything. We have to get a weapon. So we're going to pick this up. And it's actually quite annoying because the wilderness, it's there's no like quick way to telly up here from this starting location. So we're going to have to pick this up, run up here, get my mage arena cape because it's just a solid cape all around, whether I go magic or not because of the magic defense. I want to buy some runes. And then we're going to use those runes to come down and kill some lava dragons to get at least three kills so we can get some black dehyde. Now, I'm on the normal spell book, so I can't tan them, but we did pick up a needle and a thread, so we definitely want the option to tan them if we're given the option. And then after that, we got to try to get food. And it's just, uh, we'll probably come in here and kill greater demons to get gold bars so that I can, uh, you know, make those into recoils. And it's just a lot to squeeze in in 30 minutes. I'm going to stop rambling, start the timer. Pick up the dagger. We have to use the dagger or any other weapon we get in this region. And let's go. Definitely want to snag one of these guys because, again, whether I go magic or not, it's just a solid fucking cape to have. Plus 10 magic attack, plus 10 magic defense. All right, this is kind of the tricky part. Actually, could I just claim runes? Let's see what it gives me. 200 law runes? I mean, that's... I guess I could... Like, is that... That's not cheating, is it? I don't know if that's cheating. <laughs> uh, they're kind of useless anyway. I guess I can maybe get money out of them. I, I might just drop that. I, I don't know if I'm allowed to do that. Uh, wow, that was expensive, though. Oh, uh, fuck. I, I, why do I feel like 100 isn't enough? We'll buy, like, an extra 20. And then an extra one of these. Fuck it, just to be quick. 900 coins left. I don't like that. Let's let's bank these law runes. Just snagged a second sapphire. Uh, was right here. Sorry, I stuttered really bad on the recording, so I decided just to override it with this right now. But anyways, just picked up a second sapphire. Uh, we could easily make gold bars, or at least, I mean, we, there is a furnace we could use here. Um, but. If we can't, I mean, I'm sure we'll get a furnace in another region. Let, let's just focus on killing these guys, and then we're going to go to Greater Demons, get gold bars, and get food and stuff like that. I love how I had to get a steel dagger to not even really use the steel dagger. I just needed a weapon to attack something. And can we talk about how sick the lava dragons look now? I don't know when this update dropped. There, there was an update today, the Defender of Varrock quest, and I don't know if this came out with it. I could easily check, but I haven't been here for a while. This They, they could have looked like this for a month for all I know. Um, and it's a really good thing I got some extra runes. I'm a little nervous, actually, that 120 still isn't enough. <sighs> that would be the worst thing in the world. First kill coming up. Drop some of these water skins. Oh, room jet. Like, I guess it's coins to sell to a shop, but, like, oh, let's actually see the high alk value on this. Uh, all right. I, I suppose it's fine. I decided to say fuck Lava Dragons. I killed two of them, was hoping to get a lucky Alk, was hoping to kill three of them at the very least. But it turns out that all the other... Ooh, that's big. But yeah, it turns out all the other places except Mortania actually have a Tanner and Black Dragon in them. So it's not really a big deal unless I just get Mortania and no other location. In, in that case, I'll have to settle for like Black Dehyde Chaps, which would be really annoying. But you know what? It's not the worst thing. I have pretty high hopes that if we do get a Tanner, we'll also be able to round out some more Black Dragon kills. But yeah, I'll probably be here the rest of the 11 minutes left we have on the timer because of the food they dropped, the gold bars, and I could easily just run down a 20 Telly using the Concape, regen my stats and come back. Um, I'm actually out of prayer, so I do hope this trip kind of ends soon so I can come back and put on Pity. Um, with Let's see how many kills we've gotten so far. Four kills, no food, which is kind of annoying because that's the whole reason why we're here. Venge sacks. You guys, you guys know the drill. You guys know exactly why we're here. Uh, I mean, can I just get food instead? <laughs> a great drop, but it's not really what I want. Oh, I was a little nervous it wasn't going to happen, but there's the goal. Oh, and vengeance. One. Oh, man. Come on. One. Oh, Addy 2H. That actually might be a better DPS weapon for this region. Uh, what? As weird as that sounds. Um, we're going to be heading down to uh, Ice Giants. I, I know there's only three minutes left, but if I can kill like two extra Ice Giants compared to the demons, then it's, then it's worth it in my opinion. Ancient Ice Sack? How many though? What's with the one? What's with the ones? Ooh, Jug of Wine. Actually, that's kind of useless because we get lobsters for the fight anyway, but we just got more Ancient Ice Sacks. Oh, holy shit. We got the kill in time. Let's fucking go, boys. Death Runes? Ha. All right. Oof, that's loud. Um, all right. 
You know what? Let's pick up that steel dagger again. Who knows? We, we might need it. I mean, no way. All right, guys. We took off Crudian Desert and we took off the wilderness. Let's see what we get. Oh, I'm going to have to... Oh, Link, what are you doing adding this fucking wild... I, I don't know. I'm going to have to look what the fuck this even means. It's on, it's on the wiki. I'm sure Link explained this. I mean, I will also explain it to you after I take a look at it. Right, so I'm going to read off the unknown locations. We have the Cosmic Altar. This is all on the wiki, by the way. Cosmic Altar, Fossil Island, Harmony Island, Lithkrin, Mosley Harmless, Ungull. I don't know if I'm saying that right. It's, it's the Vorkath Island. Xanaris. That includes Puro Puro as well. We're not supposed to resource skill, but Link actually did write in his in his little notepad to me that catching imps are allowed, and I'm assuming he's allowing him for this very reason. We also get Xanaris, which is really fucking nice. Um, I don't really have the money. I guess Puro Puro try to get money and maybe buy a dragon longsword. Is that better than this though? I'm actually not sure. I guess Pearl Pearl is going to be the move. I mean, I'm, I'm not going to be able to kill any, like, Fossil Island Wyverns in this gear. I'm not going to be able to kill any uh, Rune Dragons. All right, 30 minutes in, the Kevos Lowland starts now. It's slightly better than I thought it was. Only just slightly. Um, oh, there's a Slayer staff, but I can't get the runes together. That would have been great. Uh, okay, so I'm going to get myself some Boots of Stone. I don't actually need them. I do have the diary so that I could go down into the dungeon without them, but they're just free, you know, gear. So might as well take them. Um, spiny Helmet. Jesus Christ. Uh, we won't get a Mirror Shield because I'm going to get myself a Rune Spear here. But there we go. We got a little bit of gear. We've got a bit of gear, which is nice. Um, and then we're going to trade with this guy. And yeah, it's going to be a rune spear. Um, because there's nothing else to really go with. Uh, so, boom. We have ourselves a rune spear. <laughs> spiny helmet, some boots, some slayer gloves. We're going down and I'm going to be killing worms. Because they drop a dragon dagger. They drop um, like red dehyde chaps. They drop some rune. They drop some addy. Uh, I'm probably going to die a little bit here. But... You know, it's alright. We can just tell you straight back. It's all good. I'm going to pray mage and yeah, just hope this is going to work. It's really not started very well here. Uh, I don't know whether it's worth... It might just be worth having piety on the whole time. Like, I guess I could flick as well, but is it just worth having piety on, tellying home, coming back? Like, that might be the best strat here. There is our second kill. Oh, red DR chaps. Yes, that's going to be huge for the magic defense. <laughs> Oh, that's insane. Oh my god, yes. You beauty. Part of me wants to go over to um, Lizardman and get some Zeretian fabrics. And that way I will be able to mage. I might go for a cheeky hybrid. <sighs> do I want to do that though? And then I need to get thread and a needle. So let me see if I can get thread and a needle here. Um, and then I might go and do that. Needle and a thread just sat there waiting for us. Lovely stuff. All right, and then we're going to go kill some Lizardmen for... Actually, I'm not going to kill Lizardmen. There's a quicker way of getting Zeretian Fabric. Uh, if we steal from the stone chests, it's like one in four, which would make a lot more sense. So yeah, if we just pick lock these chests, we should be able to get ourselves some Zeretian Fabric fairly commonly. All right, that's everything I'm going to need there. Uh, let's make a bottom and a top i don't have enough thread so we're going to quickly nail it back to get our stats back get back to the house and pick up some more thread and then we'll make the top and that's all i'm going to use i'm not going to bother with the hat as well just because i think we'll end up with something better by the end um, and i've only got four minutes left anyway so all right that's time up i did just pick up a few other things like a bucket tinder box knife rope just some stuff that was sort of laying around here so all right my third of four locations is gonna be mr lynn okay that we can work with that is good all right we're starting at the furnace in xanaris unknown locations that is kind of a weird one but i like it i like it we're gonna start by making 
our ringer recoils. Actually, just sapphire rings because I forgot to get water runes, but that's okay. There'll be plenty of essence and blings for us to catch when we're doing Puro Puro and fire runes for Alx and everything. Um, there also is black dragons here. I think you need a chicken to get in there. There, I haven't really looked around for a chicken yet. There might be a chicken in here, actually, that I can kill. Um, in any of the unknown locations, there might be... I'm not sure. I'm not sure. But we need a weapon anyway before we even go through that plan. So as I'm catching Implings, I will do some deep dives into that. Uh, depending on what we get and how much money we get, obviously, maybe we can get a Dragon Longsword. Maybe we won't. Maybe we'll get some armor upgrades. We're kind of at the mercy of catching Implings. And depending on our luck, we will take it from there. But this is definitely our safest approach. So let's start that timer. And let's begin by making two sapphire rings for two recoils in the fight. We actually need to sell some stuff because we need to buy impling jars for 2k each. You can bare hand in Puro Puro, but uh, we're probably going to sell like three a world and just be really quick about it. If it's too slow, we'll just fucking yeet it. But they're 2k each. And although you can bare hand, you can't bare hand and not squeeze it in a jar when you're in Puro Puro. Kind of weird, I know, but it's always been that way. Uh, actually, I think there were, there used to be a time where you couldn't actually bare hand at all in there, uh, but you've always needed jars. So if we talk to this guy, can I buy a few impling jars? I think you could buy only 10 a day, not that it matters. We're only going to buy one, actually, because I think if we have one of any impling, we can get three jars for it uh, by trading him or exchanging. I don't know which one it is, but we'll figure it out. So let's just go with this young impling, and we could just farm some jars and just go for higher level implings and probably gourmet implings as well for some food. I don't know the next region I'm going to get, and for food, I mean, I guess Wilderness was good for food, but after seeing it being, like, impossible to actually get uh, a, like, a good weapon, it's a lot harder than I thought. Boom, three impling jars, just like that. We'll probably do it a few more times, and then just start catching like crazy. Hey, Curry! I also think uh, the nature implings, actually, I know for a fact, they drop a magic log sometimes and i could also get a knife from a baby impling and i could also get a bowstring from a young impling i think it's possible to get an msb and we have the magic imbued scroll and we have some black dehyde and if we get an msb if there's a way to get some some arrows all right we got some water runes so we can do this and this let's just fucking clear up some of our inventory here uh we don't need water runes anymore smoke runes i guess those were only fire runes we got four diamonds um, I guess, I guess babies do drop a ball of wool, don't they? So maybe power ammies on the horizon as well. Magpie coming up. Uh, what do we even just get? More diamonds? And that's the bowstring. We just need the one in 10 magic drop. We will get it. Man, this place is so awful without stand pots and, and freezes. Back-to-back <sighs> irate -back seeds. Like, come on, man. We actually just got the knife. It, it's funny. I could just buy that so easily, but there's something so much more thrilling about just getting it from an impling. A magpie. It's okay. We redeemed the magpie. For a pineapple seed. Something's in the air right now with these magpies. Oh, <gasps> okay. Let's fucking go. I think we just need... Uh, wait, what is it? Diamond earth runes? Shit, I think I got earth runes and dropped them. Uh, that's fine. We'll, we have 10 minutes to focus on some essence implings as well. There's a dragon impling, but I don't think I can bare hand it. <sighs> I'm gonna fucking cry. All right, we have a magpie. <laughs> oh, we get three ring of recoils. Are you kidding me? And a coconut. All right, this is gonna be five nature implings. One in ten. Come on. No. No. Oh, there it is. 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 Uh, short bow. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. We need arrows. Three minutes. I was hoping to get it earlier so I could actually use this to kill the black dragon. Um, I mean, three minutes. I'll, I'll, I'll quickly look to see if there's an arrow shop here. If not, I'm just going to keep catching. All right. Here's like five gourmet implings coming up. Anything good? Baskets of strawberries. Oh my god. Remember that meta? Not really sure if that's going to work here. That we get base higher. Ugh, are awful. All right. Six seconds. Uh, let's just open up these two right here. See what we get. Crap. Crap, 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 crap. Uh, I mean, not really too stoked on this haul, to be honest. The only thing I'm happy about is a magic shortbow. Although we don't have any arrows. So we better fucking hope the next region we get 
has arrows. Although, we got nine of these. Holy shit. We got more of these. Didn't need them. We got some food. Rainbow fish. Like, what does that even heal? Is that even worth it? 11 hit points. It's not even worth bringing to the fight because we get lobsters as base. Um, I mean, some alkables, alkables. We don't have much cash, but also got an extra magic log. I don't know how, why we need that, but all right, let's take unknown off the wheel. Apply wheel changes and let's spin. Let's spin. Come on, come on. Great current. We could definitely get arrows there, and I'm I'm happy to I'm happy to see it. All right, I'm gonna start my timer here, and I'm gonna go ahead and finish off making this Zeretian top, beautiful. And then of course we're gonna get ourselves some gloves here. I'm gonna buy rune gloves. I probably could sell some stuff, make some money, and get barrows, but I do wanna have some money for the last location just in case there's like a really good weapon or bit of armor I wanna buy. Next up, we're gonna hit up Zaf and get ourselves a cheeky water staff boom very nice i've actually decided against buying runes i think what i will do is uh grab myself a rune chain here i can't buy a rune chain and rune legs i don't have enough money for both uh, but if i do this i mean this is a pretty solid little setup if he does go like a different combat style if he goes magic, this still probably holds up pretty well. Yeah, plus 19 magic defense. Um, and if he goes melee or range, we're, we're quite tanky. So that's probably the way I'm going to go. Then we've got the magic switch if I want to. But the problem is the runes. Although I do have ice sacks that we got from the wildy. So I guess I don't really need to buy runes if I want to do this. No, I definitely do want to kill something. I want to kill Ankus. So we're going to buy an Addy Sword. I'm going to use that as my weapon. Uh, we're going to kill Ankus because... They drop weapon poison, and then I'll be able to poison the dragon dagger, which would be pretty nice. All right, I'm going to have to dip from the Ankus, unfortunately. No poison whatsoever, which is a real shame. Um, 47 of them killed, and it's 1 in 50, so we're just under drop rate. Uh, I'm going to go to the dig site now, um, but we're not actually going to go to the dig site. We're just using the telly to get here. I'm going to hit up the uh, Rag and Bow Man for a Skull Helm. There we go. So this is an Addy Full Helm. But it has no negative mage stats. So, yeah. Really, really happy with it. Uh, we got one minute left. <sighs> I don't really know if I can do anything, to be honest. Shall I kill an armored zombie? We'll kill an armored zombie. That's that's what we're going to do. Some oak planks and an irit leaf. We're not going to get another kill here. So, I will stop the timer. Boom. All right. We're going to find out where my last location is going to be. Let's spin the wheel. And where are we going to go? Ooh. We got the other category. Now, this is just on the wiki. When you go to locations, there is um, a thing called other which me and Kins thought would be a good idea just to chuck in to have something slightly different. So I don't really know where that's going to like send me. So I'm going to have a quick look and I'll let you guys know. All right, we have 30 minutes on the clock. Nice and simple progression here. We're going to alk slash sell everything to this shop. And we'll probably keep around two nature runes just so we can alk any like rune items if we get it. Because I do plan on killing necrols in this 30 minutes. Um, but we can't use this. We can't use this. And we can't use this in this region, which is really annoying. Um, but we can certainly sell everything. We'll sell this as well. And we're going to just sell it all, get food, focus on getting the food first. We can get sharks in this region. And then we're going to focus on like buying earth runes, buying more fire runes if we need it, killing necrols for alks, killing black dragons. There is a tanner in this location. And then hopefully we have enough money at the end to get a lot of rune arrows. If not, Addy will do. It is a lot to cram in in just 30 minutes, but we're going to try our best. So... Let's start that timer, guys. All right, I sold everything. I also got rid of the green dehyde chap, so I'll just keep this for now. I can't see me bringing that, but it's chump change. Let's actually put this on there. I cannot believe we fucking got a imbued clue scroll. And yeah, we're gonna have to do two trips anyway, because I know I'm gonna burn some, so it's not really a hindrance that I have uh, stuff in my inventory. But Let's do this real quick. I know I'm going to burn some. I know I have things like a few cram wands and a few curry, but sharks do heal better than both of those. I'll, I probably still will bring the cram wands, but all right, we have 17 sharks in the bank. Already ate through six minutes of time just doing this. We're going to telly home, get some run back, and go right to Shazian to buy ourselves a sword.
actually, screw buying a sword. I need a safe spot, a black dragon. So, I mean, I don't, I don't know if I want to... Uh, do I just buy the arrows now? I don't think I am. It's super quick to get back. So let's buy a maple short bow. Such a weird premise of buying this when we literally have an MSB imbued. Uh, they're really dirt cheap, and I don't want to worry about picking them up. How much am I spending on that? Six, uh, well, started two. Okay, whatever, 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 whatever. Um, let's go to Black Dragons. Let's go to Black Dragons. All right, I'm a little silly. I completely forgot that the Black Dragons here are brutal Black Dragons, and they would absolutely demolish me unless I wasted all my food or took 20 minutes to literally attack it, do some damage, and then telly out, regen, and then keep going back and forth. And then it takes one person to crash me, and that's all over. So we're we're gonna make black dehyde chaps alk the plate skirt. We can alk the plate skirt now. That's gonna be our arrows. 70k for arrows. And we're gonna do rune chain body with black dehyde chaps, which is actually still a really good combo. It actually gives better defense than black dehyde body. And um it actually gives better defense than black dehyde body rune skirt, except for magic and range. So it's it's kind of just a give and take depending on what combat style he goes and if he goes magic it doesn't matter i'll have range now the tanner is like awkwardly in here tan hides 200 coins i mean i have the funds but hot damn that is that is pricey can i do one at a time oh i think i just hit the one option all right let's make this and then let's make this it's annoying it's red dehyde vams but like it's not the end of the world i realized i just messed up and i actually used the msb to kill the red dragon so it's a little penalty i'm gonna just stand here for a minute and run down the clock for the difference in time it would have taken me sorry guys earth runes earth runes we want 20 earth runes let's take off this ker pow and that gives like plus six range attack uh so we have this bow on plus 108 that's that's good. All right, we're just gonna buy everything we need now. 400 coins each? Fuck, we're gonna just buy some more of these real quick for the Necrols that we're about to kill to go for a Rune Fulhelm upgrade. If I buy 10, I'm gonna buy 10 of Worlds. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna buy 10 of Worlds, I'm gonna buy 10 of Worlds. And we're just gonna go through and just probably dump all of my money on Rune Arrows. 150 Rune Arrows. I'm gonna check this shop right here to see if I can upgrade my Helm real quick. Blare, I can't. Okay. All right, we're here. We're at the Necrils. I thought about actually going for Grubby Keys, but I figured I can just zip through these guys and I have a much better chance of getting a Rune Med or a Rune Full Helm than I do a Grubby Key. And a Grubby Key doesn't even get me a Helm. It just has the option of going to be a Super Defense and a Range Potion, which is really good. Don't get me wrong, but it's a little rare for me to be YOLOing with 12 minutes left when I feel like there's a really good chance I could get a rune helm here oh rune square it's a shame it's kind of pointless uh with my gear set up but i guess it's money i mean could i buy anything i don't know if there's anything else i could buy as an upgrade all right that's gonna be it guys i can't kill one in 16 seconds so i'm just gonna pause the timer there it's funny i got a dwarf weed and they also dropped wine of zamorak and i was like oh man there's a chance i could actually get a ranging potion here uh but no Nah, we didn't get it. All right, guys, I think we did pretty good. I don't think we did great, but I think we did pretty good. The The real thing that I don't like is my black medium helmet right now. I'm, I'm just thinking that there is a shop that I missed that I could have gotten something better. But all things considered, I think we had some pretty good regions, and I think we did pretty well. Our stats are looking really good. We got really good range attack. We got the magic shortbow imbued. We have rune arrows, an amulet of power, decent armor, aside from the helm. Really good magic defense. If he goes magic, I'm not worried in the slightest. Super Restore. I am going to bring the two Blighted Crambons in case he has like a spec weapon for a combo eat. And we also have two recoils on top of it as well. So I think we're going to pack a punch. I think we do a lot of DPS. Armor, not so much. I mean, I'm lacking a shield. The helm's bad. But in terms of DPS, I think we're, I think we're going to be putting some numbers on him. So let's see what Link has and I'll see you in the fight. Okay, I will uh, show all the locations on screen so you guys can see it. Um, but there's just like a load of random locations in the other. I I don't really know where the rhyme or reason is, but that's what we uh, had as an option. So the top one there, Apatol. 
uh, which is where I'm going to start. And as you can see in the inventory, I've got a load of stuff I had from uh, the rogues chest earlier. We've got loads of runes that we can sell, literally like 600 natures, 1,000 laws. Uh, we got a load of those gems earlier. The rune spear I bought, some dragon stones. Um, unfortunately, I don't think I'm going to be able to make a glory because I'm on the lunar spellbook, which was a really silly choice, to be honest, because uh, I've I had no way of getting astral, so just sort of pointless. I thought it was a good choice because of the spellbook swap, but, you know, it's the way it goes. So I'm going to start this timer. And we are going to start selling to this shop. It does buy for slightly more than um, normal shops. So I'll probably just sell like 50. Um, 10 natures. We'll sell a ruby. Yeah, I'll probably just go through this fairly slowly. Actually, can I do this? Can I one-up this slightly? Where's the crafting shop? There's a crafting shop here, isn't there? Do they sell a chisel? Because I might then be able to chisel all of these and sell them for... Oh, you beauty. Lovely. Uh, yeah, I could I could chisel all these and then sell them for more. So I might save those. But yeah, I'm just going to slowly go through all some of this stuff. And obviously the, the goal... What am I doing? There's a rune shop right here that's definitely going to buy for more. 114 coins. Obviously, I have sold a few laws, so this is not going to reflect it well. But Jesus Christ, it's so much better. Uh, cool. So, going to use this. And, yeah, I want to go for 100k so I can get Scimitar, obviously. All right, that's going to be enough. Just selling the law runes seemed to be the best way in the end, to be honest. Uh, so, let's get ourselves a Dragon Scimitar. Very nice. Means we can sell off this Addy Sword. We'll sell those off as well. Uh, I still got the Dragon Dagger, which I genuinely might keep. I might hold on to. Um, I'll hold on to one Dragonstone just in case. I'll probably hop one more world, so 50 more. So I've just got a little bit more money to work with. It might be worth just selling all the lore runes, to be honest. All right, so just before I move on, I didn't sell them all, but we've got 82k now. That should be enough. I want to see if I can use this without a light source. Uh, I don't know if I'm just going to take a load of damage. You see it? Yeah, you can't attack anything. Okay, all right. Uh, just because they dropped prayer potions, which would have been really nice. But yeah, I had a quick look. There doesn't seem any way for me to get a light source at all, which is a shame because I could have got them in my previous areas. Uh, right, so another area on the on the list is Feldup Hills and the Mids Guild and all that. So I'm going to use the Mids Guild now. And then we're going to go down into the Corsair Cove Dungeon, which again is on the list. And we're going to get ourselves a mythical cape. Very nice. Load of bonuses. Very happy with that. And then I'm also going to trade with the Herb Law guy here because we got a Guam earlier, which means I can make an attack potion for the fight. Lovely stuff. Uh, and now I'm going to go down into the Corsair Cove dungeon there and I'm going to try and get myself a Myth Kite Shield um, from the Ogress Warriors. Just got Rune Medhelm. Which I don't know how to feel about, because the, the Ram Skull, ugh, now I'll be attacked by you. I'm saving my prayer for if that did happen. What we get in here, we get minus three attack bonus and only a few, like, defense bonuses. I don't even know if it's worth using. And there's the Myth Kite, and I've just realized I've been a massive idiot. I've got an Irit here, so I can make a super attack. So I'll just go and make that. Luckily, the Eye of Newt is the thing I can buy, and that's what I need. So, yeah. There is the shield. Very nice. Got a magpie imp playing. Oh my god. <laughs> yes. Oh, magpie, you have done an absolute beauty there. That is so big. Oh, that's like 20s. That's 20s there. And we get less magic attack uh, or more magic attack bonus by using the rune kite. That's incredible. Uh, the reason I'm on the Isle of the Souls is because I'm going to the Isle of the Souls crumbling tower thing uh, to kill Forgotten Souls because they drop Qualms, which means we could then make a super strength. Uh, they also drop Snake Grass, which means I could make this Raynar into a uh, prayer potion. Just got a Taramin, which does mean I can make a strength potion. Um, part of me is thinking about dropping the Mage because then I could go Rune Medhelm and attack potion strength potion and i think that's gonna be better if he goes mage then you know okay i that's that's the way it goes but if he goes range or melee i think i have a really good setup and it's better to take a setup that's going to beat two combat styles over one so i'm gonna give myself like another minute or so and then i'll use the telly and i'll buy the vial 
um, and all that good stuff so that we can make up the um, strength potion. All right, we didn't get the super strength together, but that's all right. Let's put that in there and that there. And boom, I think I'm ready. I'm ready for the fight. Let me get my stuff together and I'll show you what's going down. Okay, so this is going to be the setup. We are rocking uh, a plus 26 magic defense in this, thanks to the Red Dehyde Chaps. I think the Mythical Cape might be helping and the Ruined Gloves as well there. Um, 155 in all the melees, 161 in the range. Like, we're pretty solid if he's going any of those. Uh, maybe having the Rune Plate legs would have been great. But then maybe he goes magic, and I'm buzzing that I don't have room plate legs. We'll see. Um, and then obviously we've got the 75 slash, which is pretty solid. 75 melee strength, um, and obviously a four tick weapon. We got the dragon dagger switch. weren't able to get poison on that unfortunately, which is a shame. Um, but we do have the super attack, the strength potion, half a prayer pot, and then I'm bringing one blighted anglefish for the start of the fight, just so I can be overhealed. Um, but they changed blighted anglerfish that you can't overheal once you've been attacked anymore so i'm just bringing one of them and then the rest is the blighted mantas i think i've done pretty well here i think i've done pretty solid to be honest so yeah let's hop into it see who's gonna take this one kiddos hello hello how did that go you enjoy it uh i i definitely enjoyed it it was a weird one in the sense where you like your planning couldn't ever be too deep because yeah. you don't know where you're gonna go next yeah so it was kind of like you just well at least my idea was just do the best things you can do in the in the region and just kind of hope it all falls together nicely i was sort of the uh, same and like i was trying to pick up items here and there in a region if i was like oh that might be useful in future but then i still forgot yeah. some items i was like fuck i should have picked up that when i was yeah, there and yeah so yeah i don't i don't know about you but i i did minimal planning between each one i didn't sit there for like an hour with the best strat i just kind of went balls deep and right. i definitely forgot a lot of stuff too so okay all right Good, good, good. Let's go, Helm. Uh, okay. Aye, aye, aye. Mm. <laughs> ah, okay. We like that. We like that. We like that. <laughs> oh, All right, let's go for a big reveal here. Gloves. Oh, okay. Did he, uh, does he actually have gloves? He does have gloves. Yeah, I got. Does I have got, gloves. I got does the chest. Gloves. I got the chest. Uh, let's go. Let's go. Ring. Uh, I don't have one because I was on lunas so i couldn't ah is, is that what or yeah wow okay yeah, yeah no, i, I, I could have not see your big dilemma yeah i i probably could have made a glory and recoils not gonna lie uh yeah i have a recoil i have two recoils okay yeah it's not ideal not ideal let's go booties mate don't have any okay some boots of stuff mm. <laughs> uh let's go cape Ooh. okay another giveaway for me here Ooh, did you have? Did you? I for I forgot the weird regions. I got had. other. It was like other. other. I got other. Yeah. <laughs> did you get other? Oh, he got the wildy. Oh, wilderness. I got the wildy as well. Not gonna lie. Let's go legs. Oh. <laughs> okay. Okay. I see where this is going. Uh, I'm not sure you Red do. Red I'm not sure you do. Yeah. No. no? I mean, no. no, I don't think you do. I don't think you do. Let's go necklace. Don't have one. Ooh, nice. Love to hear that. Nice, Love to nice, hear that. nice. Yeah. Okay. Mm, let's go shield. Don't have one. Mm, see, I think this is where things go different. Uh, yeah, that's not ideal. Magpie um, impling. I was going to say, the nuts. first thing on the top of my head is was, was magpie. Because yeah, the second I... thing on the top of my head is rear drop table, and it's a lot yeah. more likely body. Prize. Be... Oh. Don't, don't tell me like another fucking impling like flu. Nah, I bought this. Face. I bought this. I bought this. I couldn't afford the plate legs. Okay. Oh, did you get? Did did you get desert? No, I got um, Mistalin, which had the champion's guild in it. I've just got a weapon, dude. I do as well. I got two. Oh. I, I feel like a mace is one of them. Okay. Put on one of them, Link. Put on I'll any put one. On one of them. Then we'll put on... I'll put on one of them. I it got it as a drop. Mason. I got it as a drop, the dragon dagger. From what? From worms. Wow, we really <laughs> had 
I mean, I guess we had the wilderness crossover, but I think everything else was different. Uh, yes, I think so. Fuck, does he have the poison spear then? Could you poison? I just have one weapon, so count us in and... All right, three, two, one, go. Oh, oh he's got oh. it imbued! I got it imbued! Oh my god! Dude, wilderness, unknown, I, a lucky, Im not, not a lucky, a young impling for bowstring. I got a knife from a baby. Wow. I could have spotted it. A knife from a baby, a nature thing, one in ten magic log. I just fucking made one. Wow, man. that's 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 I like that. I like that a lot. Thing, you know. Oh, yeah, no. Yeah. Okay, right. I know you have one too. I Put don't. It up. I don't. You didn't get one? Oh, right. It's prayer pots you get from the new rogues chest. Yeah. They just updated it, guys. And it, right, it's I only need, half I need pot. Have some sort of... It is only half <laughs> pots. It is only half pot. Um Okay. Oh, okay. All right. All right. I'll, I'll, I'll hit you with those. Ooh. I made them as well. Made them from scratch. Ooh. I know it's going to be oh, like a full, Just put it up. Just put them all <laughs> oh, okay. Come on, You've done well. You've still done well. Though, it, you know? Dude, I, I, I've seen those rogue chests after yeah, the update, they're, they're bro. Broken. I, they they're are ridiculous. Broken. Okay. All right. All right, dude. I mean, this is, this is going to be a good fight, I think. All right, dude. You hit me with that two-second warning and we'll... Um, all right, man. Pot up now, pot up uh, now. I'm I don't have any pot pots. Tricks. Pot tricks. Pot tricks. I'm All right, healing this is your as well. two second warning. All right. That's a Great huge and blows. start. Great and blows. Oh, the speed, man. The speed. I don't know. I'm accurate. I'm accurate. Okay. So are you. All right. I got the recoils, though. I know you got spec. I got to be a little careful here. Uh. Okay, I'm just gonna eat guys if he's I mean, going. The MSBI is actually a very good weapon as well. Very good weapon. Alright, alright. Oh, he was camping fucking low. I, oh. I I wanted to I wanted to yeah. suck both of them out of you though, know, you know? That, yeah. That helps. That helps. I mean you you also could have died in the process though. Uh, <laughs> like, unlikely, you're bold, unlikely. You're a bold man. Rigor doesn't affect that shit, so yeah. I would have loved to see all the, the complaints about how hard it is to be T Link <laughs> if you died right there though. <laughs> Uh, if this goes down to three HP again, I'm gonna cry. It honestly. will, it will. <laughs> and we we know I take those fights. Yeah, so. they are your speciality for sure. Mm. Well, I thought you weren't eating for a second there. Ah, uh, are we gonna? Oh, Ooh, it's a good see. It's a good thing we got. Oh comp. my god! She's out of spec. She's got to be out of specs. That was a twenty-two twenty-seven. That second one <laughs> is fucking huge. Holy shit. Wow. Holy shit, my heart is racing, bro. <laughs> Two massive specs. The DDS never done. It's Dragon Dagger. We, uh, you know we're going to get ruined for calling it a DDS. Dragon well, Dagger. I mean, like, we've been making that mistake for five years now. Everyone's we're not been making that mistake for five years. I know. <laughs> and, like, it's, like, and it, it's crazy because 99% of people know just to, like, let it be and not call yeah. us out. It's the fucking 1% who are like, oh, I got him. And there's a little gremlin there in the comment section thinking he's, like, hot shit. Like, oh, I got the boys. They're my, wrong. I'm my right. My favorite is when someone calls you out on something. It becomes, like, the top comment, which, yeah, fair enough. Everyone's like, that's funny you're right and then other people comment like is someone really not going to call link out for calling it a dds it's like the top <laughs> comment is yeah, literally yeah. what you call <laughs> oh, no i know exactly what you mean we're gonna we're gonna pot up we're gonna pot tricks here we go Fuck, i'm not fucking hitting anymore i'm a beast now mate oh here we go all i did was have <sighs> to complain is, for a sec train there yeah come on I'm surprised we can't I see him, Link, but there's another accurate. friend here watching us. That's two videos in a row. We rarely have Hello. friends. How are we? Yeah. Hello, friends. Yeah. Oh, come oh, on. Oh, yes. Come on. This is bad. How? Bro, they need to nerf range, dude. It's fucking Dude, broken. I think you're winning. So pipe, mm. like... I don't know. So I don't know be, about that. Look, before you lose... Man. Oh, hold, okay. Hold oh on. my <sighs> god. Where was Behave. this fucking before? Behave, man. Oh my you're you're literally on a train. Eat again, Link. Eat again. Eat again. Eat again. Eat again. <sighs> I, I knew it was coming. 
I risked, now I risked that one. I just, just for needed fucking it. zero. I just needed it, you know? Oh, no! Oh, you had two specs? Yeah. That I did not see coming. Yeah, I, I didn't think you did. And I was like, I could have him here. <laughs> and the third spec. Oh, my God. <gasps> oh, no. I thought you were out. I thought you were out. Eat, eat, eat. Yes. And again. And again. No, no. Come on. Don't, don't let me down like this. Don't do it. Start, start singing Don't Let Me Down by the Chainsmokers. What a song. Great song. Oh, my God. That's exactly what I needed. He's out. He's out. He's out. So he am I. Eat. So am I. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Don't do it. He's dead. Dead. Oh, my God. 21 HP. Why? Why every time? Every. Every. <laughs> I hate it. Baby, I that's hate... what I'm talking about. No, you've been talking about that that's for like what I'm 10 fucking months talking about. now. I win those. Team oh, Rog wins those, baby. Team Rog wins those. Oh, I can't believe that. He's so... Guys, this happened, this happened in the last like seven times you've been in that situation. <laughs> So oh, Fees and G's, thank you very much for watching. Go check out Kins' channel. He did upload a PvP a few days ago if you haven't seen that. GZ, mate. GZ. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Don't forget to download Raid using my QR code or the link in the description.